In the heart of Africa, beneath the surface we tread upon, a silent story unfolds, unbeknownst to most. It's a tale of the Earth itself, a narrative of transformation that has been unfolding for eons. Today, our journey delves into the heart of Africa, where the continent is quietly and imperceptibly splitting into two, reshaping the very fabric of our planet. As we traverse the vast plains, towering mountains, and lush jungles of Africa, we are oblivious to the geological drama that quietly plays out beneath our feet. The African continent is undergoing a slow and inconspicuous metamorphosis, a transformation that challenges our understanding of stability in the natural world. To truly grasp the magnitude of this unfolding geological drama, we must first journey through the annals of Earth's history, understanding the forces that have shaped continents and, in this instance, led Africa to the brink of division. Picture the Earth in its infancy, a turbulent cauldron of molten rock and cosmic debris. Approximately 4.6 billion years ago, our planet was born through a process of accretion and intense heat. The Hadean Eon, a period of immense turmoil, saw the formation of a solid crust as the Earth's surface began to cool. As we fast forward to the Archean Eon, around 4 to 2.5 billion years ago, the first continental land masses emerged. These early formations, though modest in size and composed of simple rocks, laid the groundwork for the continent we now call Africa. The Proterozoic Eon ushered in the assembly of the first supercontinent, Rodinia, around 1.3 billion to 750 million years ago. This colossal landmass, a precursor to the continents we recognize today, began a cycle of fragmentation and reformation that set the stage for the eons to come. The story continued through the Cambrian Explosion, a period around 541 million years ago marked by a proliferation of life forms. As the Paleozoic era unfolded, the mighty supercontinent Pangaea took shape, dominating the Earth for about 150 million years during a time when life on land flourished. Pangaea's reign eventually gave way to the Mesozoic era, a period of breakup and divergence around 252 to 66 million years ago. Pangaea rifted, creating Laurasia in the Northern Hemisphere and Gondwana in the Southern Hemisphere. Within Gondwana's boundaries, Africa emerged as a distinct landmass. Now, as we find ourselves in the Cenozoic era, the continents continue their dynamic dance. The Himalayan mountain range, formed by the ongoing collision between the Indian and Eurasian tectonic plates, bears witness to the forces that continually shape our world. Transition to the present-day African continent. Africa, a continent celebrated for its diversity, cultural richness, and natural wonders, is now the stage for a geological transformation that often escapes human notice. The East African Rift, a tectonic plate boundary running through the eastern part of the continent, is the focal point of this silent drama. As we stand on the precipice of this geological spectacle, the question arises, why is Africa splitting into two? And what are the implications of this subtle yet profound transformation? The Earth's crust, seemingly immutable, is in reality in constant motion. Tectonic plates, immense puzzle pieces making up the Earth's surface, are responsible for the shaping and reshaping of continents. In the case of Africa, the East African Rift is a manifestation of these underlying forces. Scientists theorize that a combination of tectonic activity and mantle plumes may be driving this continental rift. The Earth's mantle, a layer beneath the crust, is in a perpetual state of motion. Upwelling magma from the mantle could be exerting pressure on the African plate, causing it to crack and split. Geological processes, both seen and unseen, are the architects of our planet's ever-changing landscapes. As we peer into the geological depths, the silent rift beneath Africa becomes a testament to the relentless forces that mold our world. Now, how will this splitting of Africa affect us? The implications are vast and profound, echoing far beyond the boundaries of the continent. 
As the African landmass undergoes transformation, the repercussions touch multiple facets of our interconnected world, warranting a deeper exploration of its potential consequences. The East African Rift, where the continent is cleaving apart, harbors ecological treasures. Its expansion threatens to fragment habitats, isolating species that have evolved in harmony with their surroundings. This fragmentation may lead to a decline in biodiversity as species struggle to adapt to their changing environments. Moreover, the redistribution of land masses and the formation of new geological features can reshape the flow of rivers and alter water availability. Such changes can have cascading effects, impacting not only the wildlife, but also the human communities intricately linked to these ecosystems for their sustenance and livelihoods. As the African continent undergoes metamorphosis, the intricate dance of climate patterns may be disturbed. Alterations in land configurations can influence wind patterns and ocean currents, potentially contributing to shifts in global climate systems. This, in turn, may manifest in changes to precipitation patterns and temperatures with far-reaching consequences. Turning our attention to societal impacts, communities residing in regions affected by the rift may face significant challenges. The evolving landscapes demand adaptations from those who have long adapted to the current geography. The potential for migrations and shifts in cultural practices looms large as these communities grapple with the transformative forces beneath their feet. On the flip side, the creation of new landforms and the prospect of a new ocean could open up avenues for economic development and resource extraction. Strategic importance could be assigned to these emerging geographical features potentially reshaping geopolitical dynamics in the regions affected by the continental split. Amidst these challenges, a silver lining emerges. The possibility of a new ocean forming could bring forth opportunities for scientific exploration and environmental conservation. Coastal regions born from the rift may become hotspots for diverse ecosystems, providing scientists with valuable insights and a chance to study the resilience of life in novel environments. The timeline of this geological spectacle remains elusive. The slow dance of continental rifting suggests that immediate effects may not be apparent, emphasizing the importance of ongoing monitoring of seismic activity and rift evolution in regions such as the Afar Triangle, the East African Rift Valley, and the Red Sea Rift. In conclusion, as we stand witness to the silent drama beneath Africa's surface, we are reminded that this geological transformation is not merely a local event. It is a planetary symphony, a subtle but profound reconfiguration of the interconnected threads that weave through continents, ecosystems, and human societies. As we conclude our journey into the clandestine heart of Earth's transformation, we encourage you to stay connected as we delve further into the enigmatic tapestry of our planet's evolution.